Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Spirit Lord of Honsai. In the last episode, we worked on stabilizing the realm, and Hibatari is now my march. Good for them. We also stole a gem from these guys, and now they hate me, so that's fine. Uh, yeah, our alliance network is weak, but it's not the worst in the world, I guess. Phaeton, they would, they're fighting who? Who are you fighting? Oh, they're fighting up there. I think having you guys as an ally will be helpful. That should be four out of four, yeah. Whoops, not that bad right now. Because my legitimacy is alive, okay. Okay, there it is. Now we can do this mission. Very nice. Alright, the Ghost Congress. It's time for us to finally reform our current government to adjust it to our special situation. The estates have sent a list with demands for them to give support to such an undertaking. All they want is more power. Who would expect something else? Nevertheless, we are in dire need of a reform, so we should do our utmost to make them happy. Ghost Congress happens. Very nice. Finally, the day has arrived. Delegates from all estates gather in the west wing of the palace. The bribes have worked, and everybody important attended in person to this event, later called the Ghost Congress. They all came prepared to milk our state even more than we promised them, but they made a critical error in their plans. Most of the people here have never met the Ghost Emperor, and as soon as he entered the venue, and as soon as he entered the venue, everything was under his control. His presence demanded absolute devotion to to one single cause: the development of Honsai and to take revenge on all who wronged us. As a just ruler, as a just ruler, the Ghost Emperor granted the privileges he promised, but denied all further inquiries of which there were only very few. After a very efficient and productive meeting, the Congress ended totally in favor of the Ghost Emperor, the people left invigorated by the spirit of Baihan Sin, now dedicated to the cause. Very good. So we get a new Tier 1 government, which is... Reformed Ghost Emperor. Gets rid of a lot of the bad stuff. For example, yeah. Among the earliest government types known, known to man, the country is ruled by a single individual with undefined power. Cool. Yeah, so minimum autonomy is going to go down, so that's nice. It's going to get, like, two extra crowns? About two, yeah. Decrease health of intolerance. Oh, okay. Don't be mean to them, please. Yeah, of course they are. And it looks like we're maxing out on admin points. We're doing on tech. Oh, good. Grab it. Okay, so we got a couple things. Rule of the Driven Emperor. Our land is the last venerable is the last of the venerable Baihan Sin, a nation ripped apart by pointless in internecide conflict. Internecine conflict? I don't know what that word means. The last emperor, known posthumously as the Driven Emperor, overheard his sons plotting to shatter his hard won empire into squabbling statelets. Though he might have loved his children, the mere idea of this disunity was more than he could handle. Mad with rage, prepared their deaths. Yet found he loved them too much to kill them by his own hands. For this deed, he hired an executioner, his first mistake, to kill them all. He failed, and one of the slayers of Unity fled north, where he prepared the destruction of Baihan Zin. Understanding the nature of his failure, the driven emperor used a lost comb ritual and killed himself to live as a specter, seeking to dedicate his very existence to saving the empire he so beloved. Even with the forbidden ritual, his efforts fell upon deaf ears as the as the hated separatists tore his empire apart. It matters not now, for the driven emperor still wanders Halan, rendered from his corporeal form, and his presence fills us with the very same stuff he exists from. Cool. Which is legitimacy and core creation cost. Uh, what do I need for this? I need to be by Hunzen. Cool. We're gonna do that. Reform the Baihan Zen. The Baihan Zen once defied fate itself, routing Jahair's forces and seeking southern Hales from his foreign empire. Since then, many have tried to recreate the alliance of old, but it has always faltered, shattering into feuding warlords. Now we can reform by Hunzen and return to our primordial role as the defenders of Thininkai. Cool. I think we're gonna get new ideas. What else would we have gotten? Cool things, but they don't really matter. Really like corruption. I would have liked that one. Maybe I recover speed. That would have been fun. Uh, let's click the button. Very nice. 
Our state is going through da -da -da -da, new traditions and ambitions. Yes, please. And we have a new idea. Buy Hans and Ideas. Reunified at last. Through war... Through war near unend unending and unspeakable violence, Bai Han Zin makes its long-deserved return for the third time in history. The Empire is one land, led by one emperor and run by one government. Our title is a prestigious one, and well-deserved. The warlords of Hales quake before what we mean for their fate. We shall restore peace and order to a shattered land. And for this, the peoples of the land beg our salvation. Very nice. The Reborn Kingdom. It is done. At last, the revolts from both traitorous kin and unfaithful allies have been put down, and the lands of Bai Hansen once more know the tranquility and prosperity of just rule. That, however, is not even the height of our accomplishments. We have, at long last, brought true unity to our lands, as never seen even in the days of Jaehaer's foolhardy attempts to conquer our great nation. Now we stand as one, and we shall see to it that nothing shall ever again shatter our unity. We shall beat back every moat of darkness, and show all Hales true righteousness. Uh, cool, permanent claims. And a new way of prolonging the Ghost Emperor. Let's see what we need to do here. Uh, money and artist. Basement power 8 in that province, and a fort and a barracks. Okay, gotta go after them. It's fine. Points. We're not gonna do that one yet. We're not going to do that one yet. Uh, coastal defense or naval battery. Total navy size 75% of force limit. Well, that's fun. Do you need to be base manpower 8, I think? The fort. Base manpower 8. Wow. That's a lot. That was a lot of reading we just did, huh? Jackals. Fine, you can... Mm. My money. Which province? You know what? Be devastated. I don't care. Make poor money. Make poor, poor money. Hmm. I do have permanent claims on this stuff. Just only to ask car. Hmm. Maybe going for it's good. I think I'm gonna go for it, actually. That'll be fun. Do I need to directly own it? Yes, I do need to directly own it. Okay, we're just not going to take the palace. They have Pomari in there. I want those. Uh, we're just going to have Feng Shui come in on this one. Honestly. Honestly, I don't think I need it. <laughs> I think we could just take them. But you know what? Yeah, let's get Feng Shui on this. Just have him take Azkar. Don't need much more than that. Y'all can go there. Gonna grab that. Can't quite get in there, can I? Oh, yes, I can. Oh, yes, I can. Come on, back. Kill them. Kill them in their mountain hold. Dead. Military leader left us. Not that one, though. Yeah, come get them. Get their army. Very nice. Army destroyed. They have nothing left. Very good. So what we're going to do is we're going to separate out, what, half of these guys? The main army goes up there. You guys are going to go after these. Wonderful. Uh, you grab another general. No siege. Whatever. Six shocks are really nice. Alright, looks good. As car. Money. Thank you. 
Yeah, that looks fine. I'm not gonna give him their. You can have that. That's fine. I'm okay with getting you a little bit stronger. Yay, we helped. I wonder where that army even came from. Well, this is a fun little war. I don't have claims on this, but we're taking it anyway. I think we're taking everything except for the hold. I'll vassalize them in the future, I guess. Oh. I need a guy. Take approval allegiance, that's fine. Hmm. Yeah, I'm pay the loans. We're gonna get a bunch of money out of this anyway. It's fine. Army's way to glory, very nice. Ooh, what do we got? Succession. <laughs> Not doing that one just yet. I mean, we can, but like... Mm. Yeah, we're gonna wait until I get... Uh, very nice, okay, good. Magical elites like subsidized students? Well, it sucks, I guess. Sucks for the subs. Subsidies, but whatever, I guess. Is this looted yet? No. Ah, there we go. Wonderful. Okay, I want that. Give me that. Oh, I can just take this, too. Hmm. That is a tough question, isn't it? Do I just take the whole... Do I just take it? That is 400 points. I have 400 points. I'm gonna say no. And instead, give me your money. Yeah, we'll vassalize them next time, I guess. Because I don't want to rebuild that hold. Okay, very nice. We did that. The Northern Granary. The first step in taking back control over Southern Hellas lies in the Northern flood Floodplains. The region is rich in farmable land, producing grain, rice, and livestock, feeding most of Southern Hellas. Historically, the dwarves of Verkul Ozovar they spelled that wrong. Or did they change the spelling? There's an extra H in there. Interesting. Have ruled over the Kai people living there, while paying tribute to us. Let us not repeat this mistake and free our brothers from dwarven rule and directly take control over the rice fields of the southern of southern Hellas, weakening the dwarves and further isolating them in their mountainous hold. Uh, nice. Uh, okay. I do still have enough points. Yeah, let's do it. The succession. The sons of Kaban Song thought to impose their own succession plans on Great Bai Hanzen and paid dearly for their treachery. But they were not wrong. That there will come a day where we must carry out on our patriarch's legacy without his presence. We must ensure a smooth transition, fully in line with the Ghost Emperor's will. And to do so, we should start planning immediately. So we're going to prepare for succession. All the estates and famous families gathered in the capital city of Tuan Bai Han Sin. They all met in the palace to honor the Ghost Emperor and to discuss the time after he left the mortal plane. After a week of feasts and other debaucheries, where they plotted and made alliances, they finally all met in the Grand Hall of the palace to debate about the future form of government and submit proposals to the Ghost Emperor. Sometime later, they presented two options, the Twin Emperorship. We could keep the Ghost Emperor nominally as the ruler of Bai Han Sin, but install a co-emperor to assist the Great Emperor, who deals with affairs on the mortal plane, or the Ghost Council, a form of republic where the Ghost Emperor would still be nominally the head of government, but every estate and all the powerful families would have a seat in council, electing a new counselor to represent them and function as the head of state. Hmm. That's a really good question. Do we want to be a republic? Are there really republics over here? Is Phaeton a republic? Come on. Yes. So there are republics over here. Tian Lu, I believe, is a republic. You're not. Oh, good for them. Hmm. Uh, that's interesting. I'm actually gonna reload an autosave. That's why I didn't want to do this, I remember now. 
We're just going to reload the autosave on that one. Because I don't really want to click that mission just yet. We're going to click that um, at the beginning of the next episode. Because I want to actually get some guys, some of y'all's feedback. And I was thinking about it. I think we can actually hmm, change what we're going to do. I'm not sure if I want to release them, because I definitely could. You could release them as a vassal. Eh, not going to. We'll just take it again. It's fine. Listen here. We already read it. Uh, yeah. So, for the next episode, we're going to decide... Can't repeat the loans. We are going to decide in the comments. Disability increase. Cool, I'll take it. Our decision to give more power to local magistrates has ensured the people of... Of importance, feel good about our government. So they've been telling everyone how well they are being governed. All right, come on, give me this. Ventures insult the clergy. Ventures can be nice. Why is your loyalty so bad? Forty-eight. Everyone hates me. Of course they do. Come on, guys. Just finish the siege, please. Just finish the siege, please. You know, actually, how about everyone likes me? Would you take a 100% peace deal right now? Of course not. Okay, but what if I leave you with those? No. Ah, that's annoying. I would really like to get that province without breaking it. They're not even going to give me all their money. Little butt munch. Just die. Why won't you just die? Worries not read books. Thanks again. Appreciate it. There we go. Alright, give me that. Give me all your money. All of it. And war reps. Alright, cool. Both of you come right here. I'm going to pour everything. I'm going to click this mission, but not the succession. We're not doing that one yet. In the meantime, we are going to get a claim on this. They can deal with that. Internal migration of dwarves. Sure. Move them. That's fine. Uh, military access. Just started. Okay, it's not that bad, I guess. Um... Do that. For some reason, they aren't revolting, but whatever. I'll take it. Okay, okay. Things are doing pretty well. Let's get rid of some of these bad loans. Yeah, we got a couple more. Okay, we just have the estate loans left. Nice, nice. And all I had to do was pillage people. From the seas all the way to the... What's that called? The Focal Range? Yeah. Uh, let's see, who's coming up? Honsai, nobles. Come on down. Uh, extreme monsoon. Um, yeah, I can have some relief effort. Uh, Whispers of Ascension. Ooh, this is a fun one. Strange tidings have arrived from a far corner of our dominion. A famed inventor, known for his keen intellect, background in mining, and love of fine wine and cheese, has turned his sights to a new field. It seems to be... He seems to be sowing strange and miniaturized flags, seeking to render our great banner in ever smaller replicas. Normally we would be content to leave such strange minds to their wandering. However, strange rumors have arisen around his endeavors. That they are not simply an eccentric project, but are, in fact, a quest towards some mysterious ascension. Some argue that we should allow this brilliant man his due, and trust that there is a method to what may seem like madness to us lesser minds. Others point to the Day of Ashen Skies as a grim reminder what can happen when that logic is followed too far, and insist we intervene now before it is too late. No, no. Now this is fun. I lose a couple base tax and get uh, something in return. I forget what I get. I think stability. Sounds about right. We need to have a coastal defense, and I need more navy. The art is level 2, and you need to be fort level 8. Or, not fort level 8, but like, you know what I mean. Manpower 8. There we go. There we go. Empire 8, there's that part. It needs a barracks. Uh, 
Alright. Hopefully they'll pop off soon. And hopefully these guys don't pop off before I get a chance to get rid of them. Who do we got? Um, land maintenance, land force limit, discipline level 2. I can't really afford a level 2 advisor. It's like a level 1. There's that. Very nice. Let's get these fully stated. Not you guys. Uh, next is... Get that claim. Very good. Don't need any more than that. Hmm. Okay. Everyone's in except for you guys. So instead, we're going to drop autonomy down, please. Oh, they converted those to ancestor worship. Okay, I guess I'll have to deal with that. Any others converted? Just two of them. Okay. Yeah, religious zeal. They'll have religious zeal. Yeah. Okay, there's those two. Very nice. Alright, a Rockland is no longer a valid rival. Of course not. Who do we got instead? Shin Bin Rong. Cool. I'm fine with that. I tried, dude. Really did try. Okay, uh, time for you guys to go down too. Very nice. Woo, prospering times. Let's see. Where? Capitolini. Uh, this province is silk. I would like you to do production. Yeah, be nice. You are no longer a valid rival. I only have two valid rivals. Cool. I'll take it for now, I guess. I only have two forts. I do need more forts. First, we're going to do the barracks. Alright. Agenda of the Diet. Right, they got to do that. Denaraj. Oh, they're actually decently strong this time. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's do that one. Can we? Plus 100. Maybe. They're actually decently strong this time. Mahalong gets a marketplace? I mean, I guess, sure. Or... At war with Thunderfest! Where are they? There's Bloodsong. Where's Thunderfest? There it is. No! <laughs> why would you- why would you- <laughs> You're a doofus for that one. Um... Yeah, I'll take this one. That's fine. Any other missions we got? No. That needs the barracks. And money. Okay. Apparently need a lot of cash. Hmm. When can I get rid of that? Right of Council, that's fine. I want supremacy with the crown to be gone? That one, cool. Get out of here. Thank you. Ooh, it's time. I'm gonna get some bad stuff going. I want you up here. Yeah. Right here, please. Those are there. Those guys are the only other ones. Okay, cool. Okay, that'll be fine. Okay, let's grab that marketplace. Okay, there's the first one. Very nice. There's the second one. Very nice. Okay. Looks like it's working out pretty well. Got to deal with them. They're coming up. It's fine. Ooh, look at that. We might be able to grab that island. Might be able to do that. Okay. Is that pink white? They still have a lot of boats. Wow. Yeah, this province is going to get ruined. Oh, you butthole. Oh, you butthole. Go get them, please. That is extremely annoying. Arachlan, I hate you. Arachlan, I actually hate you for that. <sighs> Invest in a new idea. Oh, both of them. No, just offensive for... 
that. We're doing attack. Four years ahead on both of them. I'll take this one. Defender of the Thinning Kai. Nearly no power in all of Hales were the equals of Bai Hanzen, and there were none that came even close in southeastern Hales. Kingdoms from all over the area paid tribute to our empire, prostrating themselves and showering their de deference to the emperor. Of course, this came with a benefit. We would protect those who paid us tribute. Few tried, and fewer succeeded in their invasions. One came closer than most. The elf Jahar marched upon Hales, seeking to subjugate it to elven rule. Though he nearly succeeded in subjugating Bai Hon Sin, 300 defender defenders held a fortress for over six months, which allowed the rest of the Thinninkai to rally to their defense. Jahar could not face the full might of the empire, try as he might. Then we watched then we protect the Thinninkai. Now we shall now we shall do the same. Let those who submit to us fear no harm. Very nice. Um, I'm actually, I, I, I do think getting you on my good side is going to be, uh, being on your good side is going to be a worthwhile endeavor. Right, I need the coastal defense. Right there. One of the missions. Money. Money. Coastal defense and navy force limit. What is my force limit on the navy? 17, cool. Let's grab some more barks. That'll do for that. Shifting halls, growing walls. Cool. Um, adventures can suck. That's rather annoying. Clan reveries come to a head. Just be nice to the dwarves, honestly. It's fine. Ugh. A lot of money. Not worth it. Uh, let's see. What's over this? Next one. Balance of power is always fun, however. Spin Temple Rights is also good. And it gives me Advent Advisor cost, too. Mm. I'm just gonna go with, uh... Yeah, let's do Temple Rights. That's fine. Sounds fun. Mixed Temple is a lot more useful. Risk of Trade. Um. Fine. Oh, there's only one loan. That's not that bad. Now oh, they ended up leaving. Some soldiers. Yeah, sure. Whatever. That's fine. Could be worse. It's not that bad. Sertan, who are you allied to? Don't care. Start spying on you, then. Someone to go after. And Chen be wrong. Interesting. So that's how we go after them. Duck. Eh. I can wait a couple years on that one. It's not so big a deal. Now this. Let's grab that one. Haha, <laughs> I need it. And what are these I can convert? Uh, that one? Cool. Let's do that then. Uh, there. How long? 25 months. Not bad. Yeah, get rid of the Ancestor Worship. What do we got? Not doing that one. Who's asking Frocklin? Screw you. Oh, there's a the boat. Cool. Uh, get rid of that. Come over here. Go help with this, please. Very nice. The Coastal Defense. Year after year, we get reports of our coastal cities, telling us of plundering and horrible atrocities from the pirates. The trade flowing through Kaikom Sin is getting blockaded, essentially blocking us from the lucrative trade routes to the Gulf of Rahen. We should erect coastal defenses along the shore to block the pirates from landing. Gives me a secure coastline. Uh, gives me a reward, I guess. Cool. Secure the coastline. If we wish to dominate a pirate, to serve as a subject, you will need to do so by force. But recent experience shows taking them all on is a fool's errand, and the Ghost Emperor's realm does not suffer fools. Should we first target the red-haired Devils of Prukakin, or the Dread Queen Ping, who has caused us so much suffering? Hmm. Prukakin, interesting. Who are they allied to? 
Oh, that sounds fun. Push a proof again, yeah. Cool. So that's gonna be the next war. That's gonna be fun. Monopolies? Sure. Livestock's getting big, nah. Mining is melting. Incense? Incense is fine. Mining is melting is fine also. However, livestock is getting too big. Give me that money. Hmm. Mm, yeah. Go get them, please. And the port. I do have money for this now. When the great elven conqueror Jahair came to Holas, he conquered all before him. Rahen crumbled, and though the warrior monks of the Shia fought him off once, they succumbed the second time. But the great fort at Taibao, that held him and all his invasions off for years. It is a place of pride for our people. But during the recent strife, it has fallen behind on maintenance, and grown a shadow of its prior self. As we claim our past glory in so many ways, we must restore Taibo as well. Yeah, because we ramparts. Cool. And local defense until the end of the game. Nice. Okay, how long do we have on the Emperor? He's got 15 more years. Uh, I could reclaim him as an Empire, but I don't think we're going to do that yet. That gives me Empire in name only, which is really annoying. How big are we? 300. Kingdom size, at least. Yeah, go get those guys, please. And, of course, I got that. And we're going to get these guys out, too. Provoke. Get them, please. Thank you very much. Claims on arrivals. I will take that. Thank you very much. Okay, and that'll be all the time we have for this one. Uh, actually, let me grab a claim. Six, five, three, let's grab this one. And tell these guys to start claiming stuff. Cool. And you guys, I can grab a claim on one of these. Seven, eight, ten, grab that one. Okay. Between episodes, I'm going to run a poll, and do we want to be a republic, or do we want to be a monarchy? I want you guys to decide, because I think that's going to be fun for interaction. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you next time.